Hi Collective, welcome back. This is Goddess Nicole Tarot. Back to drop you another energetic read for the Collective for my beautiful and handsome Soul Tribe members. How are you guys doing? I hope all is well. I'm on the late night ship, okay? <laughs> I'm on a late night ship, okay? And I will probably upload this tomorrow, so that'll be Monday afternoon so i couldn't sleep tonight well i'll be uploading it today because it's after 12 so yeah i, I keep forgetting that collective <laughs> but anyway how are you guys doing i hope all is well i hope your overall health is doing good with that being said thank you for the continuous love and the support that you share with me here on this channel yeah thank you for all of the comments the likes the shares the subscribes, the interaction overall with the channel. Thank you so much for that. You are greatly appreciated, okay? If you have not become a part of the Soul Tribe, please be sure to do that. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you find the reading resonates with you and select all once you hit the uh, bell notification. You'll have access to all of my content, all of my uploads. You'll be the first to be notified. For those of who have been with me for a while just make sure that you check it back periodically to make sure that you are subscribe yeah. subscribe to the channel i'm sorry all right <clears throat> for those of you that are new here i do cuss on this channel i it just depends on what energies i partake in what energies i embody the channel messages the channel songs all that plays a part over here we get the messages out there clear and concisely to the collective and truthfully. We're finna get a prayer before we get started. <laughs> Holy Spirit of the highest white light, protect me and protect my collective as I tap into the energies. Ooh, the smoke is really thick. Something is thick, y'all. Anything that is not of you, I ask that you close and shut that portal, shut that door. Don't allow negative energy into the reading. All right, let's get it, guys. Um, I kept hearing news. So some of you guys could be getting news about something, about a certain situation. Could be getting news about um, finances. You can get you. You could be getting news about approvals. Um, you can be getting news about death. Uh, about birth okay just news in general this could be negative or positive news but whatever it is here you guys are receiving it some is not good others is not good either so i chose to use my what's the news uh oracle deck so we're gonna see what comes out of this oracle deck whether it's positive or good okay we're going to see what spirit has for you guys. I hope all is well, okay? Let's see. What spirit has for the collective. What they need to know here, spirit. For the collective. Yeah. Oof. Somebody that ghosted you, collective, is getting some type of news. Okay? They feel lost without you. This could be somebody that has a lot of cowardness about them, okay? This person could have disappeared over a lot of times in your life, okay? Some without warning, okay? Somebody could have just cut you off cold, talk, uh, a cold turkey. They didn't respond to your messages or your calls, your emails. This person is receiving some type of news here and it's not good. This person that cut you off, left you on red, left you hanging, okay? Didn't close out a cycle with you, okay? Didn't give you closure. Whoever this is, they feel lost without your energy now. This is a person that likes to disappear. So they would come into your life, give you a little bit, and then they're out the door again. <laughs> And you won't hear from this person, whoever they are. So somebody feels lost with them. I'm hearing that uh, Robin Thicke song. I'm lost without you. Can't help myself. How does it feel to know that I love you? 
somebody is lost without you, Pelesi. What about this loss here, okay? Wow. Somebody that could have got you locked up knocked up here collective taking however resonates here eat the meat and spit out the bone only take what resonates with you okay and discard the rest but whoever this is somebody could have knocked you up and got you pregnant and cut you off they ghosted you or this is somebody that is lost without you they got somebody else knocked up and ghosted that person okay it says knocked up pregnancy expecting mothering so somebody got somebody pregnant and they ghosted this person child somebody is lost without your energy they could be going through it with somebody they baby mother or somebody they cut off and ghosted they feel like a coward because they got this person knocked up who is this or this could be your baby father divine feminine or my feminine energies and my collective okay somebody could have ghosted you your baby father you could have had to raise a child by yourself child that's so deadbeat whoever this is somebody is so deadbeat who would do this to somebody I, I, some of you guys felt lost you didn't know what to do when this person ghosted you your motherly instincts kicked in i feel like some of you guys that kicked you into gear to be a best mother you can be if you raise your child by yourself, I commend you guys, because I was a single mother, so I don't, I don't um, look down on single moms at all, because I know I've been there and done that before. Okay, so if this is your situation here, I, uh, I do commend you guys as single mothers. Okay, but if this is somebody else in your energy that has got somebody knocked up, they ghosted that person. They really did. If this is somebody that's losing or ghosting. Well, they feel lost without your energy and they ghosted you, cut you off, cold turkey. Uh, didn't You didn't receive closure from this person. It's because they got somebody knocked up here. Somebody got pregnant. They cut you off for this person. It can go either way here, collective. Let's see. Give us more information on this spirit. Yeah. Nummy, self-medicating, addictions irrational behavior so somebody is drinking themselves to death using drugs to self-medicate because they got somebody else knocked up they may not was in a relationship with this person or they may not didn't want to take a risk to get well they took a risk <clears throat> and they probably didn't use protection with this person this is somebody they did want to get knocked up so they're stressed they could be self-medicating overindulgent in different things to uh please their flesh okay somebody could be numbing themselves because this person is facing some type of uh, addictions their addictions could have got out of control here somebody just forgot to put on a condom or word protection taking out of resonates somebody is having some type of irrational behavior so somebody is very impulsive here very hasty with doing something or sleeping around because they have addictions and they got somebody knocked up here <laughs> wow this is crazy yeah new boo new love learning each other flirtations so some of you guys are off to a new love here okay <laughs> and you're not worried about this person this is this person's problem this could be somebody in your energy that is self-medicating because they the thought of losing you and getting somebody else knocked up is like so stressful this person could be very overwhelmed they have high anxiety. They have outbursts here. This is somebody that is severely frustrated because they got another child on their way. Maybe they didn't want this child, but they was out here not using protection. Being a dog out here, that's what I'm saying. I'm here. I'm a dog, I'm a dog, I'm a dog, I'm a dog. Treat them like a dog. Yeah, this is somebody that you have self-awareness of. You cutting through the illusions, detaching from the ego. This is somebody you spiritually woke up from, okay? This could be your child's father or child's mother taking however resonates here. Eat the meat and spit out the bones. But I feel like you went through some type of ascension or some type of rebirth or um, spiritually uh, awakening here. I feel like this collective. You learned from something here. 
and you're self-aware. I feel like you're in another relationship here or you are on your way because I feel like this is something that you were aware of that you had to get over, leave this person behind. You lost with this person. <clears throat> they could have just left you out in the cold. I feel like also that gave you the awareness that you need. It gave you the strength, the motivation that you need to get up and do things that you should do as a mother. Okay? It gave you the willpower. I feel like some of you guys are uh, very independent. You're very loving, caring. You're great mothers out here. You're doing it all by yourself. Okay? And you're cutting through any illusions where this person may have had you in at one time. And you're detaching from the ego. Fine. If you want to leave me here with this child, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to be a great mother. I'm going to take care of my responsibilities unlike you. I'm going to just put your ass on child support. That's probably what somebody is doing. Yeah, maybe you with your new boo here and you maybe you are finna come into a new boo that's gonna help you with your child, that's gonna treat them like their own children. Taking out of resonates. Or this is what you got now. Wow. This is probably what some news about. You finna find out some news about your, your ex boyfriend, ex husband, got, got somebody knocked up, child, and they don't even want the baby. They thinking about you, child. And you over here, spiritually awoke, spiritually aware. You cutting through and you're detached from this person. And you with your new boo, child. And this person is self-medicating. They're numbing themselves because they're thinking about you. But they got a whole situation going on over here, child. Who is this? Who is this? What is even this? Yeah, they was too turned. <laughs> they was too turned. It says, party animal. Sex, drugs, alcohols, surface pleasures. So this person was faced with a lot of addictions here. They were reckless out here, very impulsive, compulsive. When they now got somebody else knocked up out here, baby. Okay, you live the fast lane. You, 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 you. Uh, this is the consequence for some of you guys. You said bye, Felicia. This is not what you want. Okay, thank you, next. Leaving and not caring. So this is somebody that knows that you're not coming back. Especially when you hear this news. If you're not already not heard about this person. Okay. You probably not heard about this person having another child on the way. And you're just like, okay, bye Felicia. Or this is somebody you could have been in a relationship with. You could have and been this child's person's mother. Okay. And they knocked somebody else up while you was in a relationship with them. Yeah, this is somebody thinking about you. Definitely that. It says recalling memories, missing someone, reminiscing. This person is reminiscing why they done ghosted this karmic, ghosted somebody they hooked up with while they was out here being a party animal. Okay? Having sex with different strangers and not knock somebody up here. They were turned, baby. Somebody was a party animal. They was a beast out here. Yeah. This person is obsessed with you. This is somebody that is physically attracted to you. They, they view you as a snack. Or this is somebody that they viewed as a snack. They got knocked up here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> got this person knocked up. Now they self-medicating you. Child, they stressed out. <laughs> I cannot, yo. I cannot. It's too many. This could have been somebody they was out here just partying with. Going from bar to bar, club to club. And they slipped up, got somebody pregnant. Yeah, this is somebody may want to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you. They want to talk to you. Yeah, because they're spiraling out of control here. This is somebody that's spiraling, baby. They didn't want this pregnancy with this person. Whoever they got with, baby, they didn't want this pregnancy. It says deep conversation, intimate discussions, blunt and honest. Somebody wants to be honest because I feel like maybe this person that they got knocked up is obsessed with them, okay? It's because of the sex, the the drugs, the alcohol. It makes you do some strange things here, okay? Give me one more, one more. <laughs> yeah, this is somebody that is extra, baby. They got pregnant. Drama, dramatic, trying too hard, a starter. This is somebody who is extra. This could be somebody's toxic baby mother they got pregnant. 
but this person is a clown. Yeah. Rebelling, going against expectations, defying the norm. Somebody could be a black sheep here. So this person could, their family could look at, look at this person as a F up all the time. They always messes up their life or messes, messes, up, messes up somebody else's life. They could be counted as the black sheep. This is somebody that rebels against everything. Somebody tries to give them advice. You know, this person rebels against it saying, I'm going to do what I want to do. This is somebody that does what they want to do. And now they don't got to stop sign. They at a red light, child. They don't know what to do. Who is this person's spirit? This is somebody you said goodbye to. You over here loving yourself. And you know, she ups. this person is very, you're not lonely, but this person is with loneliness in the reverse. I feel like some of you guys are attached to a new person now. I know that I am never alone. This is somebody that you know is not alone. Okay. This person could be tied to somebody. Yeah. This is a false relationship here. This is somebody that he did not want to be with. I'm telling you, he or she taking a have a resonates. This is somebody they they was once attracted to. Maybe the the numbing of the effects of the drugs and alcohol just clouded somebody's judgment, and they just went head first. Child, and this is a toxic relationship that this person could be in, or this was you. Take it out of resonates. The lonely in the reverse. I just feel like somebody could be lonely. They could be thinking that you're lonely. This is somebody that you let go. You said bye. See ya. You was out here living reckless with your lifestyle and you don't got people knocked up out here. There's no way that you're going to have a conversation with this person. They do, they do everything extra here. They do everything extra here. You're fully aware. Who, whoever this person is, you're aware of them. You're free from them with freedom here. I possess the power and the free will to create my own happiness. And for some of you, you that's exactly what you did with your new boo here. Okay? Some of you guys are getting in the process of marrying this person. This could be your person. You don't trust this person. Okay? <clears throat> you don't trust this person at all. Okay? This ex here. Yeah. You're in love with yourself or you're in love with somebody else. This person knows that. Somebody may want to talk to you, though, and be honest with you. But it's too late for that because I feel like whoever they got knocked up is definitely watching this person. Okay? They're extra, too. This is somebody dramatic. They're in a karmic, toxic relationship with this person. Yeah, this person don't have any purpose in life. With purpose in the reverse, I feel like you're happier now, collective. This could be your energy... And you're free from this person, from your baby daddy. This is somebody that had a big ego with pride here. Yeah, this is somebody that blames others for their mess up, okay? I feel like this person is in denial too, that they're not going through things, but they really are. They're going through a lot here. This is somebody that probably has knocked somebody up that they really didn't want to be with. I'm gonna just be honest. Child, I cannot, yo. I cannot. Yeah, this is somebody that could be in a competition. Always trying to one-up you. Spreading rumors about you. Wow. This person is in a toxic relationship. This person could be watching you. Mm -hmm. Remote viewing. Looking into your life with their mind. Wow, so this is somebody could be getting readings on you, psychic readings on you, trying to spy on you, this person or this person that they're knocked up. Somebody been spreading lies about you and rumors, spreading your name. This person that could be in competition with you, the other baby mother. Yeah, this is a fake spiritualist, okay? Somebody is not spiritually woke here. Or they could be receiving readings from, from a fake spiritualist here. This is somebody that could be thinking like they're holy and, de and, and, and devoted to God or de devoted to spirit or their ancestors, but they're really not. This is somebody who is very extra. They're dramatic. Okay? They spying. This is somebody that's in competition with you. 
envious of your career and the money you make. This is somebody that's very envious. It could be this person from your past that's reminiscing, that's numbing themselves, or this is the person that they knocked up. They're ghosted this person. Your ex ghosted somebody they knocked up, and this person is mad. This is somebody who is very mad. It says business rival can't stand your grind and your hustle. So this is somebody that could do the same work as you. You could be spiritual. You could have a spiritual business. And this person could have a spiritual business. But this, this person <clears throat> may not get many customers as you. Or they may not have many views or comments or things like that if they have a channel. That's what I mean. Or they could work in the spiritual community. Okay? Take it however resonates. They can't stand your grind. You could out grind this person and outshine this person. And your hustle is your bustle. I feel like you are above here. And somebody is envious of you. Could be envious of your new relationship too. With your new boo out here. Somebody is just, ooh, a hater. Causing you to act out of character, irrational emotions. Mood swings. This is what this person going through. With this this knocked up person they got knocked up, that's extra out here. This person is going through a lot. Somebody could be drinking and drugging themselves to death. They're stressed out. They're in regret. They're in re remorse. They're in denial that you're free from this. This cycle could be closed out because there's a new boo in town. I feel like that's what closed the cycle out for you because you detached from this person. Yeah. <laughs> They could be with a shit starter too as well. Somebody who is very extra. This person could be blaming their situation that they got in on you because you could be a spiritualist. You could be a reader. You can have a spiritual business. Whatever it is, somebody has a rival here. Somebody is in competition with you. This fake ass person that they got knocked up. Okay? Take it out of a resonance. If she even pregnant, child. Somebody could be fake here. This fell right on pride. Says Jupiter retrogrades. Problems with making important life changes for the future. Benefits. Expansion. Abundance. This person has too much pride. They're not expanding. They don't have any abundance. They're not growing. They don't have any prosperity. Something could be affecting this person's moods, their emotions. This person is out of character. This person is going through ups and downs, a roller coaster ride. And this is somebody that you cannot trust at all. At all. So this person blames everybody but themselves. So they don't take any accountability for messing up their own life. And the person that they got with is just as worse. So imagine trying to take care of a child with somebody that is just ratchet. Low down and dirty. Man, you have arguments with this person all the time. Yeah. And imagine trying to be with somebody in a relationship like that. Worrying about their baby mama coming to start things. Or trying to call them in the dead of night. Oh, making up excuses. The baby need this. The baby need that. That is That, it would, that would be a, a tumultuous relationship. Being with somebody that has a ratchet ass baby mother. It's just, it's just ridiculous. Who wants to be in something like that? Absolutely not. It says, instead of worrying about the child, she's more worried about you. Absolutely not. I wouldn't give a damn what my baby daddy do. Absolutely, and they know that. I, 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 he know that, okay? I don't care who he dates. Long he take care of his children. Okay, and that's just period. It's, it's a such thing as smooth sailing co-parenting. You don't have to add to the fire. Somebody seems like they don't got somebody here that likes to be extra dramatic when it comes down to them dating and having somebody else. Oh, the minute they find out that this person is dating somebody, oh, it's a problem. I got dark entities or entities are using the people to work against you so this person got entities attached to them and the person that they have a child by they they done got knocked up here i told you this person is dark they're prideful they're egotistical 
they got a lot of problems going on? Absolutely not. They numbing themselves because it's chaotic, whatever they are. They're going through a mental storm. They feel lost. Yeah. Secretly jealous, hating on your romantic relationships. So what did I say? If you got with this person, this person that they got knocked over here will be hating and jealous. This is a shit start. Whoever they got pregnant, be glad that you happy if you got away from this person because they done got themselves into a lot of problems. Their toxic behavior has got them in some shit. Amethyst protects your psychic. Amethyst psychic protection control. Spiritual energies while dreaming can help with insomnia and nightmares. So this person could be going through some type of nightmares, insomnia, this person can't rest, they can't sleep. This is somebody that could have been, this fake spiritualist could be attacking you because they, they are in competition with you. So get you guys some amethyst, okay? This is what it looks like, okay? Somebody's definitely doing spiritual warfare here because they're in competition with you. Because this person still loves you. This could be a business rock. They're trying to affect your hustle and your grind too. Yeah. Take a spiritual bath. I'm telling you. This person is demonic. Look at this picture. This masculine could be demonic. And this feminist. A feminine. Whoever she is. She's fake. She is a hater. She's very, definitely a hater. And he's sick of this person too. Mars retrograde. Impulsive rage and anger. Hostility. Major blowouts. Fights and violence. This is who he fights with. Something about arguments. Uh, conflict. This is who they fight with all the time. They, they, that the person that they got knocked up here, or they got some a child about this person. This person more worried about you getting with this person than they worried about their own child. Don't you got something responsibility to take care of, boo? We ain't worried about this person over here. We got a whole nother relationship. This is somebody that secretly hates on your relationships too. It could be both of them. Take it out of resonates here. They're mad because you. Pay no mind to them. This person is mad that you ain't paying them more attention. And this person that's in your energy that is reminiscing about you, missing you, and they're lost without your energy because they ghosted you for somebody they knocked up over here. And now they done ghosted this person and they're mad at you because you ain't paying them no attention. How the fuck that word? You got your attention on something else. Your children and your bag and, and your new boo. You're not worried about this person. Yeah, can't stop your shine. Period. This is a clown ass nigga and a clown ass hoe. Somebody is so, they putting the blame on you because this person is ghosting their ass. They're in their pride and ego. This is something that, that you can start loving yourself. You're not worried about this person or what they got going on here. That's their problem. If they're numbing themselves to deal with this because they was out here turned up. Every Friday, every weekend, they got to be in somebody's face or in somebody's ass. That's not your problem? What? Get out of here. Tell us more about this clown-ass nigga and this person that's in competition for what? Because you're in a totally different new relationship here. Let's get some tarot here. Yeah, you are the empress here, baby. You're focused. It says... Sensual, beauty, motherhood, pregnancy. Some of you guys could be pregnant by this person. Okay? And they done got somebody else knocked up. Come through spirit with the confirmation. Fertility and beauty. Somebody hates on your beauty too. You could be very successful here, Divine Feminine. For those of you that could get pregnant, that's who I'm talking about. If this is not your child's father, or this is somebody you could have been married to, this is somebody that was spreading rumors on you too as well. So they were pillow talking to this person that they got knocked up. Now they don't want to be with her. They're ghosting her ass because they got their attention on the Empress. Child, I cannot. Two of coins. You've balanced out your energies here. 
something about the solar um something about the summer solace could be significant let go of control celebrate life have fun you're happy now something you could have let go during the summer months june july could be significant okay you could be a this could be a leo that we're talking about or a gemini or this you could be a june or uh june Lee, uh gemini or july um uh, leo here two of coins i feel like you're adapting pretty well here some of you guys have a new relationship already you're adapting real quick whatever decision that you made it, it brought you financial financial uh, windfall here i feel like you woke up here it says spiritually awoken you're prioritizing things that matter to you such as your pregnancy your children okay you're not going back and forth with this person you've balanced things out in your favor here that's what the two of coins means you're flexible okay you're not going back and forth with no hoes or no negative and that's just period about somebody you don't even want yeah this queen of wands this is who he got pregnant and knocked up she's in the reverse it's karmic this is somebody that was in secret competition with you for what always trying to one up you for what because this person still loves you yeah this person is a dark witch here this is somebody who is very dark too many irons in the fire temperamental press pessimistic demanding so this person is very dramatic not easily moved strong-willed somebody could be in that energy stubborn okay think they own this masculine they could be controlling this masculine okay could have got this person to go up against you this could have been somebody a business rival okay leo energy here with the queen of wands we got a capricorn energy here yeah man yeah five of cups this person is in a five of cups they're in a rage they're very impulsive angry all they do is fight with each other this person could have ghosted this woman because she's probably pregnant here yeah or she lost this baby she could be mourning she could be in grief my condolences if she has but this is what you get when you do dangerous things here okay this very well could be a gold digger this could be a witch this is somebody that could have got pregnant out of, because of finances out of finances trying to get this masculine stuck now he done ghosted her and he don't want to be with her yeah three of swords this person heartbroken this is why she's doing this shit she's going through sorrow heartbreak depression she could be crying about this masculine child i cannot this is crazy this is wild and she mean and hateful as fuck and it's causing this masculine a lot of irrational making uh, irrational decisions here this is somebody that's moon swings are off they're tired of this person they fed up this is somebody that's sad that they got this person knocked up you the empress over here so you you're not focused on this this person could have been with this person out of sex this could have been sex based until somebody got pregnant oh now it's a uh-oh uh oh that's what i'm hearing yeah page of cups in the reverse this woman is obsessed and manipulative about this person and this person could be obsessed with you empress and your energy somebody got a karmic child here somebody needs to do some inner childhood wounds somebody canceled this woman it says cancel events on here so somebody could be wanting to get married to this masculine and he's not feeling that Two hermit in the reverse paralyzed by fear so this person is in fear that this masculine is going to come towards by you they could be in isolation they could be feeling restricted something is forced here somebody's trying to force somebody to be with them okay this woman could be doing spell work sending you psychic attacks you may need to uh, up your protection they're in a rage here this person is really secretly jealous and hating on your romantic relationship. Hating that this person may want a relationship with you and don't want them. This is somebody that feels powerless and lonely. We got loneliness out here already. Tell us more. Because this masculine don't want to be with her no more. Yeah, two of swords. The devil. Ace of wands in the reverse. 
Dang, somebody's not attracted to the devil no more? This Jezebel. Somebody that could be learning karmic lessons. This is a karmic connection here. Very toxic. Codependent, emotional abuse, and physical abuse. Somebody could be going through this. This is somebody that is, things are coming to the surface. This person don't have any direction. Somebody needs an outlet. This person wants to run away. This masculine does. Two of swords. So they, they see clearly who they got pregnant now. They got a baby by the devil. And they're unattracted to this person. I'm telling you, that's why they goes to this person. Ace of Wands in the reverse. To the devil, unhealthy patterns. Somebody lifestyle got their ass caught up here. <laughs> Fucking out here in these streets. Boy, I tell you, two of wands in the reverse. <sighs> Somebody wants to come back towards you. They won't reaccess towards you. They want to make some adjustments. Adjustments. Somebody defined their purpose, so they're not living in their purpose. This is lack of strategy, a lack of plans. Somebody didn't plan this pregnancy, child. If they want to work together with you. This could be a work colleague that's in a rivalry with you. That could have been sleeping with somebody that you know, Empress. Take it however it resonates. But somebody wants to collaborate with you, Empress. With the three of coins here. Yeah, four ones in the reverse. This is over. Whatever they have with this queen of wands, he done goes to her ass with the child and all, child. I cannot. I cannot. Somebody got scared. Cancel event on this card and cancel event in, on this card. So somebody is not celebrating life with this karmic. They don't want this child. And they're not attracted to this person no more. So this was just a flame. Somebody he was out here partying, living life with, sexing, and end up getting this bitch pregnant. I cannot. Four of Wands in the reverse. Everybody in the community may know about this. They could have people going up against you because this masculine wants you back. Empress. But you're like, boo child, please. Boo child, please. I don't want this person. You can have them. Something about the whiny moon. Something three to something happened three to four weeks ago. Somebody could be three to four weeks pregnant. Okay. This person could be doing things under this moon. She better be careful if she doing any type of spell work. It could affect her pregnancy. Somebody needs to stop what she doing. If she's sending you psychic attacks in your dreams. Trying to have make you have insomnia or nightmares. Or trying to affect your relationship. Because this person has dark entities attached to them. She is the devil. She better stop that or she's going to have a bad pregnancy. This is somebody you gain uh, perspective from. These people are having a decrease in their life. This is why they're going through it. This is why somebody drinking themselves to death. Tower. That fell over too. They're going through a tower. Wow. Wow. wow, wow. Yeah. Nine of swords. I can't make it up. This woman is going through it. This man is too. Shocking event. Somebody found out this person was pregnant. They were shocked because they did not want no child about this person. I see two, two, two out here. Two, two, two can be significant. Okay. I see three, three out here. So 33. Somebody could be a life path number three. I see a life path number two out here. So if you're seeing two, 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 this is definitely your reading. Three, three, thirty-three. Could be significant. Yeah, ten of cups. Somebody wants the ten of cups with you. This is what this person has got canceled. Somebody don't want a family with this person. They don't want a family dynamic with this she devil, this Jezebel. That's what I'm picking up. Yeah, and that's the justice. Somebody wants the family with you. Or this is what you're building now. You're not studying this person. We got new boo out here. You could be very in this ten of, ten of cups. Uh, Empress, you could be in this ten of cups. Uh, justice here. Libra energy here. Somebody's learning a, a valuable lesson here. Okay? Karmic lesson. Somebody wants 
Somebody wants a family with you and they feel like this is going to be justice for them. But you're probably already in a family dynamic already, Empress. <sighs> Somebody's just going to have to give it up, baby. Because you're happy now and you're fulfilled. You're successful. Your business is thriving. you taking care of your kids. If this is uh, a situation with your child's father or your husband that left you with your children... Okay, if it resonates with some of you guys, even if it, it could be flipped here, this could be somebody in your energy that's wishing, trying to wish you back or manifest you back and they can't because the cycle is closed. They got somebody else pregnant that wants them back. They're crying. They're in the nine of swords. This person done ghosted this queen of wands. In the reverse, he don't want this pregnancy or want this child. He don't want to be with this person. He's not attracted to this person. And this person is losing it. They're sending you the evil eye, sending these spiritual attacks, trying to affect you when they need to be turning their attention towards their child if they're pregnant. I'm telling you, that's the judgment. Somebody's not willing to change. Secretly jealous and hating on your romantic relationship. Okay, judgment. It, it, it fell right on that card. This person is hating on you. She got a grudge against you. This is indecisiveness, self-doubt, unwilling to learn karmic lesson. What did I say? Negative self-talk. This is somebody that talks negative all the time and about themselves. Absolutely not. Yeah. This is who they with. A king of cups in the reverse. Somebody that do not have any love for them. None whatsoever. Emotionally, overly emotionally, emotional, emotional. Very manipulative, moody, repressed, withdrawn. I'm talking, I'm telling you, he in isolation away from this person. Focus on inner feelings, emotionally unavailable. He's not available to this person at all. You could be in, on the other hand, you could be in a relationship with a new boo, a king of all coins, which is the king of pentacles. Somebody that's willing to take care of you. This is an ultimate provider here. Somebody who is stable. Self sense of strong, uh, self work, financially stable, hard working, dependable, successful, grounded, abundant. That's what the King of Coins, which is the King of Pentacles, is. Yeah, some of you guys for the minute, I'm telling you, y'all are in a relationship or getting ready to. Big improvement. Okay, somebody's definitely manifesting this, Empress. You could be manifesting this. Yeah, and somebody else. You could be recovered from this relationship. Okay, or this is somebody here that's not uh, moving forward. They could be taking a break from this 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 Queen of Wands. They could be in retreat. They could, they could be moving in silence. They're trying to heal from this, or this is you. You've already healed from this because yeah, they they person did some type of spell work here, y'all. This is probably why this person crying because. Maybe she is losing her child. Okay? Because this spell work here. Something that she took an action on. And she should never did this. This could have been spell work, moon work, blood magic, whatever she tried to do. Yeah, your significant other is sending you negativity. I'm trying to tell you. This person here, this queen of wands is sending this masculine, this king of cups in the reverse. A lot of spell work. And she's sending it to you, but it's being blocked. Wow, 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 wow. They claim they did it first, knowing damn well they did, they got inspired by you. This is somebody that, that could be a copycat too as well. They know they're not the original Empress. They are the Queen of One and Best in the reverse. And this person is in denial that this masculine has ghosted her and left her in the Nine of Swords. All by herself knocked up. Child, this is a mess. Whoever this situation is, I hope it's not my collective going through this. I really hope not. If you are, I'm sending you my love and light. But if this is somebody in your energy, from the looks of it, you're the empress over here. This has not gotten anything to do with you. Child, somebody is going through it. A mess. That's why I say it's, 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 it's good to practice safe sex, man. Not just to lay down with anybody. Somebody got a witch knocked up here. Somebody that has dark attachments to the devil and entities taking over this woman's body. 
this person laid up with this person and got her pregnant. I can not. <sighs> I really hope this resonates with some of you guys. I really hope it gives you clear and concise answers. Wrap it up, y'all. Use protection. Don't be out here sideways. Neglecting your body for that. That is crazy. Stay celibate until the right person comes along. And for the, for the record out here, somebody has already got... Somebody is in a new relationship with somebody and somebody else is just getting karma and justice here. I mean, they're under judgment real bad here for spell work. I really hope this does not damage this person, baby. Y'all gotta, y'all gotta understand when y'all and y'all feelings like that and doing this fucking spell work, it can trickle down to your children. If you're watching me, karmics. Please leave that spell work alone. If the man don't want to be with you, let the man go, bro. It's not that serious. Okay? Some of you guys are going to have complications with your pregnancy. You need to stay stay off of, stay off of, off of around that, that spell work, y'all. Stop doing that shit. Please. I really hope this helps someone. Y'all stay safe. Love you guys. Take care.